another beautiful day sun is out blue sky beautiful there she is just uh cracked on uh, with uh trying to get a perfect straight line this morning uh so that line there is dead level um because you don't actually realize how much this ground here is actually sloping so yeah so it's going to build once we obviously get this line up we will do perfect courses going along then uh like i say evaluating this stone it is very thin um there's not much chunky stuff in there whereas obviously the walls that are next to it are quite chunky and the old stone is quite chunky as well so um well it's all basically like this you know so it is quite big but uh yeah we will uh, see how we go and uh hopefully uh once we get a few more courses up the wall will look a lot prettier walls always look a bit funky when they're low um but you can sort of see this this bit up here now is done you can sort of see like you know what we're trying to aim for just trying to use up the you know the bulky stuff at the bottom obviously that's going to be undercover there so you can see the mortar but um even though the walls here as well are you can see the pointing um i'll show you i think basically on this one uh pat has uh said just go for obviously a dry stone effect like so what they've done here they've sort of tried to make the stone tight as possible and then all they've done is basically just sort of rake it back personally i don't really think it looks nice um seeing it well this wall here is you know it's about five years old but you know what i mean you can just sort of see as because it hasn't actually been fully pointed and they haven't you know built it like a pointed wall it's just started cracking and obviously you know moisture's got in there bloody blah expansion freezing whatever but um what we want to try and do is obviously like i said yesterday we're gonna you know we're gonna make this a hybrid wall so we will heart it like a dry stone. Sort of seeing here, like, you know, we've obviously got a bit of mortar, but we're still trying to lay them down on these bottom bits as well. There's quite a few wheat poles where obviously I've just laid the big ones dry. We're putting in drainage as well, but um, like I say, on this bit, it's not too bad. It's already sorted basically for this section. So, uh, but we still do it anyway, you know, it's just uh, every, every little helps, you know. So uh, anyway, yeah. Nice tails, always into the bank, you know. That had a lovely face, that one, but you know, put it put it straight in the bank. Uh, lovely, it's all right. Like I say it looks a bit looks a bit messy at the minute, but uh, once I get up to this line um, and obviously get some height on it, so you know, by the end of today, really, we should uh, start seeing a bit of a nice wall. But uh, crack on, get this line up, and uh, boom, snap, build. Righty, let's go.
she's getting there. Obviously the barrel's in the way, but you can see, you know, she's literally, she's starting to form. Pretty much, that is like, I don't know, quarter of the wall. I don't think uh, the stone's even moved. <laughs> ah, that's all right. This is the sort of stone we always normally use, you see, so if we've got to take a load back, it's fine. And this is absolutely lovely. This stone would be perfect for a dry stone wall, literally, because it is just lovely thin bits, or well, probably you know, a proper dry stone wall. Like I say, this one, uh, you know, we could have done this one dry stone, but uh, it was uh, agreed by all the uh, architect people, whatever you call them, structural engineers, should we say? But yeah, anyway. We are doing good. That now, well, the base anyway, is level. So obviously got that up. Who is that level? Hey, she's level. So yeah, that is a lovely dead level line now. So obviously I've, just, I've put a uh, end stone on here because that is what I'm gonna rise to. Um, so that'll be a nice band. I'll try and get the odd big one coming through because obviously we don't have a lot of big ones. You know, obviously the original stone was, uh, you know, it's all quite consistent consistently like this um which is all right but the problem is with it is obviously it's not very uh it hasn't got much tail on it as you can see like this just looks like it's just been you know stone put down splodge of mortar stone splodge of mortar and then there's literally tipped stone in the back so yeah i don't know we did uh we did talk to them about this as well um because pat come down this morning for like a bit of a meeting and uh yeah we have advised just for the sake of a few extra meters like take it down like but because it's a you know because it's a shared owned wall it's a bit more complicated but anyway um yeah so i just want to try and get a few big stones coming through now um just because we're sort of coming up to over a quarter now just nice you know be nice to get a nice especially because we've got the flat course as well it'll be nice to get a lovely uh thick band of stone going through the old school belly course if you know what i mean on this end as well um we are going to keep we're going to keep this little bit in uh, as you can sort of see, it's exactly the same here. The stone goes all the way back there. It is literally just piled in. Obviously, this pillar thing's obviously been built as like a bit of a buttress, uh, just to sort of probably hold it in, to be honest, yeah, because obviously that wall's bowing as well. Uh, but this is, it must be, I don't really know what else it'd be there for, because it is just, uh, it is just chilling there. Like, yeah, so it's got nothing on top of it, I don't think. No, it's just, the gravel on the car park i don't know must just be there for support it must have obviously this wall must have been going but like i say we've got the main culprit really this baby it's, it's dead now so obviously once we get up we will remove this um, but that probably hasn't helped it because you can see it's a hell of a route that's the perfect middle of the wall as well so obviously that's probably pushed it forward so yeah once she goes it'll be good but yeah no it's, it's like i say it's all going good so, so get another one up there and then uh, just sort of see it in. Yeah, after today, we should be, you know, get that course in and, uh, well, what is it today? Wednesday, uh, you know, still got two days to the end of the week. So we should be sort of over halfway and then I think um, yeah, Pat should be joining us. All right, anyway, I'm going to have a coffee and then, uh, yeah, crack on with this afternoon. Lovely job. Lovely jubbly. Hey, look at that. Another beautiful day. Beautiful church. Love it. Righty. Let's, uh, let's go slurp this coffee down and crack on.
another day done. I wonder how many times I've said that. Yeah, boom, another day done. There you go, she's coming up all right. She's looking good, I think. Got a pick of the stone, it's all good. That's how you got nice chunky and uh, nice and thin. It's a bit like me and Cam. Yeah, so we got up to about, well, yeah, that's how we're not, this ain't far off a third, you know. Do, 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 yeah, about a third. Just uh, run out of muck. I don't, I hate, I hate leaving a little bit. But no, yeah, it's, uh, it's going good. Building this dead straight. So he's going to be doff straight up, no batter or anything. Just obviously sandwiching it. Obviously then, you know, hearting as well, because you've got so much small stuff as well. It's a really good way of using all that up. I know, yeah, you can see how wide he is. He's a uh, hell of a thickness. Bearing in mind, you know, that one goes down to that fin there. So he's big. That's a metre. That buttress thing there, pillar thing, is about is a metre. That's a metre, so you can sort of see. We're not far off at points, really. So it's definitely a thick wall. So yeah, we're just gonna pack up and uh, another day done. Proper time lapsey today. Tomorrow I might do a bit of real time. Get some real time building in. Uh, so we're gonna try and uh, next couple course, you know, next course on this flat line is gonna be uh we're gonna got a load of basically, you know, through stones, really big flat ones we're just gonna put through a dead straight line, so that'll be lovely. So yeah, no, really looking forward to that. Not bad for two days. Bad at all, I don't think. That's what it's looking like. Let's get all around here. See what she's looking like. It's another glorious day. Absolutely lovely. There she is. You know, two days, not bad. Well, really, by tomorrow, we should be nearing halfway. Lovely jubbly. Over and out. See you in a bit. 